My name is uh, Dustin Leverman. I'm the chair of the student cluster competition. I've been participating in the competition for roughly the past five years or so, but I got involved at SC07. While I was at the competition, you know, I met, I met um, some folks from NCAR who wanted to hire me to be an intern, and from there to NOAA, and then now I'm at Oak Ridge National Laboratory. And the student cluster competition not only introduced me to HPC, but also introduced me to the people that have allowed me, allowed my career to take off. These kind of student programs, like the student cluster competition, student volunteers, and those kind of things, pull people into the conference and bring in that next generation of talent. I'm uh, Kurt Kroger. I go to Purdue University, um, where I'm in computer science. HPC has historically been very much a graduate and PhD level topic in research. Undergrads really more just work on like robotics or mobile. It's very hard to get into HPC as an undergrad. So this is one of the great things of Student Cluster Challenge. Um, you're able to come in uh, as an undergrad and do things that you normally wouldn't be able to touch until you're a grad student. I'm Marco Heisig. I'm from the Friedrich Alexander Universität Lange Nürnberg, which is in Germany. And um, I am one of six members from our team at the Student Cluster Computing here. As a student, it's uh, an incredible experience. You get to use very, very expensive hardware. I can say that it's really easy to find a sponsor for the Student Cluster, but uh, it's an incredible experience that you get full-time access to such uh, great hardware from different vendors and can experiment with this, so you learn a lot.